Tim Harford, The Data Detective, 10 Easy Rules to Make Sense of Statistics. Dive into the world of statistics and data analysis with Tim Harford's book, The Data Detective, 10 Easy Rules to Make Sense of Statistics. Unveil the tricks behind understanding and interpreting complex data, as Harford educates readers on recognizing their emotional reactions to information, balancing personal experiences with statistics, and dissecting the real meaning behind numbers. By questioning the sources and methods behind data collection, one can avoid being misled by beautifully presented yet deceptive graphs and charts. Discover the importance of official statistics and why it is crucial to maintain a healthy skepticism towards big data and algorithms. The Danger of Letting Emotions Take Over Abraham Bredius, an art expert, was fooled by a fake Vermeer painting because his emotions clouded his judgment. Similarly, people often let their emotions guide their interpretations of information. Experts are not immune to this. However, noticing your emotional reactions to data and taking a moment to reflect on them can help reduce the likelihood of being misled by motivated reasoning. Balancing Personal Experience and Statistics a BBC radio show presenter's experience of the overcrowded London public transport system made him question TfL's claim on average occupancy. The author explains how to determine the credibility of a statistical claim and when personal experiences are informative. The summary also reveals that statistics sometimes mislead, especially in performance reviews. True understanding comes from knowing when statistics, personal experience, or a combination of both is the most relevant. What's in a definition? This summary explains how differences in definitions can drastically affect statistics and policy decisions. Understanding the true meaning behind statistics and claims is crucial to accurately analyzing and interpreting them. This is exemplified in the case of infant mortality rates in the UK, which initially appeared to be a crisis but was actually due to differing definitions of what constituted a miscarriage versus a live birth. The importance of considering definitions is also highlighted in the murkiness of claims such as the link between violent video games and real-life violence or the definition of unskilled in a proposed immigration policy. Questioning definitions before accepting or rejecting claims is essential to avoid manipulation and distortion of facts. In essence, the lesson to be learned is this, always consider what a statistic is truly measuring and understand the definition behind it. Context matters. In a world where immediate news takes priority, we must take a step back and consider the broader context in which statistics and claims are presented. The murder rate in London being higher than New York's for the first time in 2018 may seem alarming without context. However, if we consider the significant decrease in murder rates in both cities over the years, we will understand that both cities are now safer. Similarly, the wall's cost on the US-Mexico border may seem significant, but when compared to the entire US defense budget, it only amounts to two weeks' worth of military operations. To make informed decisions, understanding the full context and considering broad time scales are crucial. The Paradox of Choice the famous jam-tasting experiment conducted by psychologists Sheena Iyengar and Mark Lepper has taken the world by storm. Their findings that people prefer fewer choices have widespread implications. However, as it turns out, we cannot fully rely on scientific research to gain an accurate understanding of choice. The social science field is grappling with publication bias, a replication crisis, and perverse incentives that contribute to the inconclusive results of many studies. We must become critical consumers of research before we spread potentially misleading information. We need to consider whether or not a study makes intuitive sense or has similar conclusions to other studies before using it as a source of truth. Conformity and the problem with limited research samples Peer pressure is a force of conformity that affects people in many ways. Studies suggest that our choices can be significantly influenced by others' actions. However, researchers have found that many studies are limited to specific populations, often from Western, educated, industrialized, rich democracies, or more commonly known as weird. 
Even though Solomon Ash's study was limited to 1950s American college students, it inspired 133 follow-up studies that showed consistent results. Interestingly, people were more likely to conform with their friends rather than strangers, and women were more likely to conform than men. In analyzing data, it's crucial to consider the sample data's limitations, such as sample bias, as some types of people are more likely to respond to polls than others. Therefore, always ask yourself, who might be missing from this sample? The pitfalls of relying on algorithms. Google flu trends, once hailed as a revolutionary tool in tracking the spread of seasonal influenza through big data and algorithms, ultimately failed due to flawed patterns. This event serves as a cautionary tale for the need to maintain healthy skepticism when relying on algorithms and big data for decision making. The accuracy of algorithms depends on their ability to detect meaningful patterns, making it essential to judge their effectiveness on a case-by-case -case basis. Transparent algorithms are crucial to providing a deeper understanding of their decision-making processes and improvement opportunities. The importance of official statistics. The Congressional Budget Office was created in 1974 to provide objective and non-controversial budgetary reports to Congress. However, not every president has accepted their estimates with grace, which highlights the importance of official statistics. When politicians attempt to discredit statistical agencies, disaster can result, like the situation in Greece where officials fudged their numbers, leading to a crash of the Greek economy. Independent statistical agencies keep countries honest and are worth their price tag for other reasons, like enabling accurate per capita statistics for organizations. Official statistics are crucial for governments to make informed decisions on important issues. The beauty and ugliness of data visualization. Data visualization can be beautiful but misleading. Examples such as Detris, a flawed visualization of statistics, warn against being mesmerized by aesthetics. Vigilance and an understanding of what the graph actually says are necessary. However, Florence Nightingale's Rose Diagram demonstrates effective visualization that persuaded hesitant doctors about the soundness of sanitation measures, ultimately resulting in the passage of public health acts. Therefore, the key is to hit the sweet spot between beauty and informativeness, while remaining aware of possible persuasion attempts. Keeping an open mind Philip Tetlock conducted two ambitious studies that showed how stubborn experts were at changing their minds, and how some people were significantly better at making predictions than others. The most crucial quality in these superforecasters was open-mindedness, they didn't cling stubbornly to a particular approach and were willing to change their views when shown new evidence. Tetlock's studies proved that our mistakes in making predictions weren't as much a result of insufficient knowledge as they were of our refusal to accept data. So always keep your mind wide open, and combined with statistical knowledge, it will make your understanding of the world clearer. After exploring the lessons in other Data Detective, you'll be equipped with the knowledge to discern quality information from biased or inaccurate data. The key to becoming a true Data Detective lies in understanding the importance of context, developing an open-minded approach, and critically analyzing the information being presented. By practicing these skills, you will be able to navigate the world of data with confidence and clarity, making better informed decisions and fostering a deeper understanding of the intricacies behind the numbers.